All right, so the um, experiment uh, STEM activity that we're doing today is called um, star formation. And so the learning objectives for this experiment is that space between the stars and the planets and other large objects is not empty. It contains um, gas and dust. And stars are born when huge amounts of gas and dust clump together. The more gas and dust that clump together, the higher the new star's mass. And NASA scientists use telescopes to learn more about how stars form. So in this experiment, you've got your basket um, up high enough so that when you use your hair dryer, you can get underneath here. A container goes inside, which is going to be where the planet will form. And these styrofoam balls go in and those are your, um, the dust and the clumps of other matter that um, are in between all of the planets in what we call empty space. And so some of the questions that you would ask as you're doing this experiment is um, to kind of poke out them to get them to understand that space isn't empty, that the, gla the gas and the dust lives in between these things. And so what you do is you bring them over for the, uh, to show that the turbulence within space will cause these clumps to go. And if you put them into the, um, you're blowing them into the um, container over here. Uh, for, I forgot a plexiglass container that goes on the top to keep the balls inside. All right, so this is gonna be a little noisy, but you go through this way. And the object is to give them about 30 seconds to see how many of these balls they can actually blow into your container. You have a, another um, container that's marked off with your, meat, your um, high mass, your low mass, and your gas giant. So you have them pull this out and then you measure out. So what I created didn't even quite make a gas giant but it's the experiment goes through as, and you can take it and let them try several different ways. And so you just kind of keep a tick mark of every student that goes through there. And they were, they get the, they talk about the leftover matter that forms stars. The other parts of the activities that we did talked about the nebulas is where this particular project starts because in a nebula, the gas is exploding out, but the matter that's inside will eventually form new stars.